Water Boys. Why these bitches lie for? So fuck your mind. Uh. What's up, YouTube? Welcome to Star Life, and today I have a video from a brand that stole my heart. Crook of Hearts. Get it? Eh. So I actually do not need to do a video for this brand. It's not like we have some kind of deal where he sends me stuff and I do videos. I actually told him I was going to do a video because I genuinely wanted to. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know I put on for Crook of Hearts super heavy. About 50 to 75% of the time you guys see me out in public, I will be wearing a Crook of Hearts curve rim strap back. Especially one of the two that he recently sent me because these things are even more comfortable. So if you need an essential black strap back, I would definitely recommend one of the two that I'll be showing you guys today. Before I show you guys the strap backs I do want to show you this super dope soccer jersey that he sent me he actually only had like two left and I asked him to restock before I posted this video so that way you guys could actually get your hands on it so getting into the deets of this piece deets is short for details on the front, it says Flaunt de America. You have the Adidas logo right there because this is an Adidas soccer jersey. You have a stitching that goes down the left side, which I think is super dope because I actually like how this piece isn't symmetrical. It kind of makes it stand out a little bit more. On the left sleeve, you have the three Adidas stripes. And then on this sleeve, it says Soho, Fairfax, Wicker Park, and Paris. And if you guys are familiar with Crook of Hearts, one of the more popular pieces that I've shown off on my channel is the Fashion City Snapback. And that actually says Soho, Fairfax, Baker Park, Paris on the snapback. But yeah, really, really dope. I know a lot of you guys cop that. That is definitely a dope piece to have. And it says that right here. On the back, it says 1313, which I actually really like because if you guys know, the friends that I put on super heavy with music are my friends Blake and Grant, and they comprise Lucky Boys which is a dope little rap group. If you guys haven't heard them, definitely check them out. I will post a link to their SoundCloud in the description below. But yeah, definitely a really dope soccer jersey, and I would recommend picking this up. This is a clean, all-black piece, and it gets a ton of compliments. But really, almost everything from Crook of Hearts gets a ton of compliments, especially the second strap back that I'm going to show you guys. But first, I want to show you guys this strap back. This is my personal favorite because it is an essential piece that I can wear with any outfit. It says Flaunt de America, and then on the side, it says Coxo. USA Chicago, which is really dope. I do wish it said Tacoma because obviously I love Tacoma and that's where I'm from. But yeah, really, really dope strap back. And the reason that I needed to talk about these in a video with you guys is because he actually uses American Apparel blanks. And if you guys know about American Apparel, their stuff is a little bit more pricey. But these things are so comfortable. Like, oh my God. It looks really dope backwards. I think it looks really clean. And I don't normally wear my hats backwards, but it does look super good. And this thing is just amazing. I wish you guys could try this on your head before buying because I know every single person would buy this if they could try it on first. But it is so comfortable. It is definitely my most comfortable curve brim that I own. Like I've mentioned to you guys that Crook of Hearts makes comfortable curve brims and I don't think I've ever placed them above Fresh I Am curve brims because up until now that was the most comfortable curve brim that I own. But these two curve brims are by far way more comfortable than my Fresh I Am curve rims. And that's no disrespect to Fresh I Am. They are still super comfortable. These things are just amazing. They just fit so nice. You guys know when I first put you on curve rims a long time ago, I wasn't bullshitting you guys. A lot of you guys went out and copped them and you guys all hit me up like, oh my God, I can never go back. I need more curve rims. So once again, listen to my advice when I tell you guys, this shit is so comfortable. Water boys. Why these bitches lie for? Why? So fuck your mind. Uh. For the next strap back, we have this really dope sex sell strap back, and this one gets so many compliments from men and women alike. Almost everybody loves the sex sell strap back. On the side right here, it says $69.99. If you don't know what that means, I do not want to corrupt your little brain and tell you, but it's sexual. It was actually funny because I wore this strap back to psychology and sociology when we were talking about sexual advertising. And it's just kind of funny that the day that I happened to wear this, we were talking about sexual advertising or how sex sells, basically. And I thought that was really funny. And the teacher actually called me out and was like, hey, just like your uh, strap back says, sex sells. But um, anyways, really, really dope piece. Once again, fits absolutely amazing. I cannot recommend these strap backs to you guys enough. I will leave a link for you guys to Crook of Hearts in the description below, along with a direct link to all three of these items. And on top of that, if you guys have been looking for a really dope, clean, pink strap back, I personally would recommend this one from Crook of Hearts as well. I received this so long ago, and for everyone that follows me on Instagram, you guys have known about this because I wear this all the time. But I cannot recommend this enough. It has a little wave emoji, Crook of Hearts, Lord de Flaunt 1992, a lot like the gray strap back that I showed off a long time ago. I'm not sure if I have shown this off on the channel before, so I just want to let you guys know if you are looking for a dope, clean, pink curb rim, 
definitely check out Cricut Parts. Once again, I will leave a direct link to this item as well. Anyways, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up below. It really does help me out. Leave a comment as to which was your favorite piece and why. And if you cop any of these items, definitely let me know in the comments below. And let me know how these things fit. Because I know once you guys get these on your head, you are going to fall in love with them. And you will freaking love how they fit. And probably thank me. As always, I appreciate your guys' support. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, hey, what's up? Uh, so, anyways, guys. Um... This might be a little weird or out of place, out of pocket, perhaps. I didn't like the outro that I recorded. It didn't really seem genuine to me. And I wanted you guys to make sure that it felt genuine. And uh, I just wanted to thank you guys for watching and let you guys know that I truly, from the bottom of my heart, appreciate all of your guys' support. And I wanted to let you know to always make sure that you continue to live the star life. That's it, all right? Later. Dude, I said bye.